Brody don't pay for shit. Motherfucker, I got a ball head. All right, hey guys, it's your boy Young here, and I'm here to give you a few tips on how to run a support class. You either want to be a crafter or a healer. Either one of those. Me personally, I'm a healer, so I'm going to give you my setup for being a good healer slash reviver. So, it's nothing worse than being in a gunfight with the teammates, and he just rather can't aim or he gets outgunned. And you're the last, last one standing, and there's nothing you can do because they're rushing. Well, not today. So, basic support class. I'm probably going to run. You need something fast just in case. You don't want to have something that you're not good with. So, me personally, I'm just going to go burst rifle. No suppressor. And first, I'm gonna get. I'm gonna need to be able to heal them. I want to be able to pick them up too, and I got them. Reviver. And also, oh hell. De -de -de -de. Won't be able to get that. Okay, well. Substitute that for that. This is like my covert trader. I don't like being able to be seen in listener mode. It gives me the element of surprise where I can just pop out and go, boo, open America. <laughs> Not really. Um, yeah, it's your first day training too. And your reviver, reviver too. Covert training too. And then your burst rifle. And that right there is an all around good class. <laughs> Alright, so this is your your friend Young here making a YouTube video on how to be a healer and supporter. Fundamentals: you must be able to revive people fast. And you want to be able to heal them up as well. Um, you got two basic healers. You have your your crafter and you have your support guy, like survivor slash healer. Good to go. Watch my ass. I'm go. gonna be the virus slash killer guy. Ooh. On this class, I have <laughs> Reviver 3 and yeah. First Aid Training 2, I think. With the burst rifle. I choose the burst Watch rifle because it's just done. that gun you go. can just whip out and just do work with. It's like, yeah, you run up on me if you want to. And I'm gonna do this to you. Oh yeah, that's oh yeah, that you love it, just love it. But anyways, um, yeah. Get my uniform. One. Stuff like that. But um, yeah, this is my basic killer class for when you're in those sticky situations. When you're alive, but say you need to, to pick someone up that's like right next to you or something, and you just can't do it without them. This is gonna be the class that you're gonna want. As you can see, I just murdered that guy, and this guy is teabagging. Oh, and he's killing him, and he's gone. Anywho, back to the game video. But yeah, the basic fundamentals of want to be a healer is you want to be able to keep your teammates alive. Because if you know this game, you know the more revives, the better. 
you literally can turn the whole game around by just reviving people because they won't die and your team will continue to have the lead areas like this right here see that guy he shot but he won't have to use his health kit because i can fill him up if he will stop and this guy here he's dead but he won't be dead because i have revived i could get him up quick and heal him up at the same time if he would let me and then again you get people that just won't let you but um yeah people who need healers but won't accept us people do not like healers i don't know why it seems like Occasionally you get those teams that just love healers because you know, they love living. And then again you get those teammates that just don't really care. It's like, eh, you're a healer. Who cares? So what? You can give my health back and I don't have to use a health kit. See? That guy right there. He he could have he could have been murdered for that little stunt that he pulled. But you know what? He had young 1994. <laughs> Feel free to comment on the video, any tips that you have, or any tricks that you have that you want to share, that I'm, you know, I'm more than willing to learn anything, you know. Say you want me to try something out that I don't know about, you know, just comment it, and I will try my hardest to try it out, if it's not too difficult, and... Yeah, it's just not too difficult. Yeah, look at that. I'm filling myself up all day. Yeah, it's beautiful. That'll teach you. I'm trying to. By the way, being a healer is also a good thing because of the fact of if you're having problems with. Boom. Like you having problems with keeping your people alive? Uniform. One less uniform. Oh, no more because Come on now, keep breathing. I killing got and picking people up. You also get cans for it, as you can see. Just filling them up and getting cans, you know. Supply, well, supply cans there is. Hey, tourist, over there. Finish them off. He's just behind the there. Alive. I'm just gonna keep on healing them up here. Boom. You can fight all you want, you guys. I will. I will continue to heal you. You, you have no fear. Young is here. Haha. <laughs> and just healing and getting cans. All done. Let's go. I have 75 cans and didn't even stay in the full game. As you guys can see. I'm all done. I'm dying over here. I got this. I'm down. Done. And his head exploded for the you. game winning kill. Young 1994 does it again. And he gets the squad up. Yes, he did. That was my tips and tricks on being a support healer. And if you guys like the video, subscribe, like, share, thumbs up, thumbs down. Please go thumbs down. Um, yeah. I will continue to make these videos. Let me know how you like it. Oh, the fuck is that?